Mr. President, with the pay gap between women and men at 14% in Ireland, this is clearly a key issue. Like across Europe, women comprise the overwhelming majority of workers in some of the lowest paid sectors, are more likely to be affected by pay freezes in the public sector and are more likely to be in part-time or precarious employment. Irish families are forced to fork out 29% of their family net income on childcare, more than double the European average. We are continually told that equal pay legislation was handed down from upon high by the EU. That's rubbish. It was won by mass strikes in France after the Second World War and by the heroic strikes of female munition workers in Belgium, Ford workers in Britain and countless others across Europe. As the great abolitionist Frederick Douglass put it, power concedes nothing without a demand. It never did and it never will. It will be a struggle across Europe, including against austerity, precarious contracts and the lack of childcare facilities that will ensure that equal pay for equal work is truly won. Thank you.